Now that you have completed your SPS analysis, it's time to present the results as you would present them in a journal to a reader. You may have seen some of these results in the journal articles we've been working with. The tables do typically come in the appendix or after the body of the article. Let's take a look at what we are going to present. We've stated our hypotheses, we've run the analysis in SPSS, and now we're going to look at how the results should be presented statistically for a journal article or report. When we report in a journal article, we want to be clear of a few things. First off is the type of test we ran, an F test. So we start with the letter F to indicate an F ratio was found. Next, we want to indicate the degrees of freedom that were found in the F ratio. This comes from your SPSS output, looking at the degrees of freedom between groups and the total degrees of freedom. So we have two degrees of freedom between groups and 35 total. This goes in a subscript. Since we're not using a lot of formal mathematical notation, we don't actually need to insert an equation, although you could c accomplish this that way as well. Instead, I am going to just go ahead and type my F and hit this subscript button in Microsoft Word. If it does not appear, you may have to hit the over button or expand your window so all of these options are showing. Once you hit this button and it is activated, anything you type will appear in the subscript. I'm going to type in my degrees of freedom, first for the numerator or between groups, and then for the denominator or the total degrees of freedom, 35. Now I want to deactivate the subscript so what, do I, what I am typing appears in the standard form. I hit the subscript button again to deactivate this. Now I can type equals and present the calculated F ratio from SPSS, 0 0.160. This is how this would appear in a journal article to make it clear to the reader what statistic you found, what conditions were met, the degrees of freedom, and what the calculated value is.